So the division of gastroenterology and liver disease offers a variety of clinical services, primarily focused on gastroenterology and hepatology problems and also nutrition. And we treat uh, diseases such as inflammatory bowel disease, gastrointestinal cancer, motility disorders. One of the main features of our division is that we offer these services in a multidisciplinary uh, approach using multidisciplinary teams as part of our Digestive Health Institute, which combines services from uh, gastroenterology, uh, colorectal surgery, uh, radiology, pathology, so offering really a comprehensive uh, a diagnostic a treat treatment approach to patients suffering from gastrointestinal disorders. In research, we use pretty much the same approach, so multidisciplinary teams working on uh, important diseases, uh, trying to understand the pathogenesis, the cause of certain diseases, bringing together interdisciplinary and multidisciplinary team uh, using you know, large grants uh, from uh, investigators from different departments, different centers, really to provide all the necessary expertise. So from the point of view of education, which is one of our major goals, this gives the possibility, the opportunity to trainees, our medical students, residents, and fellows, really to learn from the top experts using a multidisciplinary approach and um, looking at problems for multiple angles and multiple views. Our division of, gastrointer of gastrointestinal liver diseases is unique in the sense that not only we have a very strong basic research program focused primarily on mucosal immunology, inflammatory bowel disease, GI cancer, host microbial interactions, but also we have a very robust NIH-funded clinical research program. So we are one of the few divisions in the country where clinicians have been able to obtain NIH funding and perform R01, NH type funded investigation in translational gastroenterology. So in terms of education, this gives the opportunity to trainees to come to Cleveland and train in our program, not only learning basic science, but also learning clinical research, epidemiology, statistical analysis, really getting the best possible training. Very recently, we have been able to obtain a combined training program funded by the NIH focusing exactly on this concept, you know, basic and clinical translational research. This is also a very unique program because it's a combined program with the Cleveland Clinic Foundation and Case Western Reserve University. And our goal in the next five years is to train the next academicians in gastroenterology uh, for the future and also uh, attract the best trainees, the best fellows and residents and students to Cleveland to train in this program. I would say that the top priority is to fully implement the Digestive Health Institute, which is a new entity at Case Western Reserve University, combining uh, services from uh, gastroenterology, uh, colorectal surgery, surgery, pathology, radiology. So our main priority is to fully implement the institute and clinical services for our patients and translational research uh, related to our uh, disease that we study. The second priority is to develop a program project grant in um, innate immunity and mucosal immunology, which is a multidisciplinary program uh, together with uh, 10 different departments here at, at Case Western Reserve University. And the third priority is to develop a, one of the NIH County Digestive Disease Centers. There are only 16 in the country, and we are applying next year to uh, obtain one of these centers, which support uh, core facility, pilot feasibility project, really give a new dimension to digestive uh, health research uh, at Case Western Reserve University in Cleveland.